Oh, that sounds beautiful, Richard. So we're going down the bottom and uh, see if we get some gold. So come on, let's go. <laughs> Oh, this is what you don't want when you're out here. Rain and hail. No gold at this spot, so we're going on with the next. Uh, I've got Marty Fine. I've got the legend Matt. And we've got Tim, all the way from Melbourne. With his wife. So, uh, on with the next. You can see hailstones. Look at that. I think it's really, really slow. But uh, definitely hailstones coming on the uh, window with the rain. That's how cold it is. Here's coming. Look at all the ice. Yeah! <laughs> oh, look at the ice. Oh my god. Who do we roll up? Matt? Where's Matt? Now I can't see him. Matt? There he is. Focus <laughs> now. Tim? How are you, Mr. Famo? Famo. There we go. We've got Marty coming up. And we just had hailstones just a while ago. The bloody wind come from the South Pole. <laughs> and we have Tim's hey, Marty, lovely wife yeah. over here. Yeah, yeah. yeah Jane. Just, just well, Matt sent us down here and said, oh, they found a lot of gold here in the diggings, but oh, there's not much here. Okay, yeah, Jane's got a target. It's still in the ladle. Still in the scoop. Bunning special. Oh, it's in a hand. Keep going. He's whittling it down now. It's a lead shot, I can see it. Oh, you're joking. <laughs> No! <laughs> oh. There you go. Oh no, and it's flat too. Lead oh. shot. Well, well, that's more determination to get the next one. But yeah, that should have been gold. But unfortunately, lead and gold, in my opinion, they sound the same. I can't tell the difference. I'm I've got to dig them anyway. Okay, on <laughs> with the next. I've got a little birdie here. Look at that. I just scraped it out. It was just sitting on top of the ground here. The STC 2300. So yeah, nice little picker. And it's been hailing, uh, uh, hailstones and wind and off and on. And there's uh, Tim with his wife. Uh, and they both got STC 2300s and Marty are coming. So yeah, this is great. Gold. Boy, this ground is heavily mineralized. Ironstone everywhere, but I came across a place like this at St. Ornard's in the Victoria Golden Triangle and man there is some gold and they're right. I just pulled out this ironstone and I've got a signal just behind it so I pulled it out with that hole and uh, and I could just see it. A little bit of gold here. Look at that. Oh, that's nice. That's a good one. That was a wiry sound, and you can see why, because it's distorted and thin. Great find. Well, here we are. This is Richard's got a... Looks like he's got a nugget. It's out now, mate. Good. Hey, um, have you ever heard of a lucky rabbit's foot? Huh? Have you ever heard of a lucky rabbit's foot? Well, look at that. That's a lucky goat's foot. Yes. I know, I just kicked it out and it was here. It was here, right here. A lucky goat's foot. Oh my god. Oh, that sounds beautiful. Let's hope it's an ounce nugget. Well, this should be gold uh, because this is all virgin land all around here. Hard, hard as a rock. Oh, I know, it's hard as a rock. It'd be, um, it'd be a couple of grams, I reckon. This is in uh, Victorian's Golden Triangle. 
Let's see what we can get. We're going to be the first one to see this gold nugget after being buried for millions of years. Set it down from an iron and quartz reef about 500 metres up the road. Oh, that sounds beautiful, Richard. Oh. <laughs> Oh, it's still on the scoop. It's in his hand. Let's find it. Is it heavy enough to work out the weight, Richard? A couple of grams. Oh, look at this. What a real ripper. Oh my God, look at that. Can I hold that for yeah. you? Oh, look at that. Oh my God. Might be three. Yeah, yeah. Wow, that's a beauty. Wow, someone even fired the gun off. Oh boy, they're scaring off the cockies. Mate, have a look at this, mate. And that's with the uh, Mine Lab GPX 5000. With the Nugget Finder 15 inch. Round coil, look at that little ripper. There we go, we'll take a photo with the owner. I reckon it might be three grand. Oh, and that stirs up the blood, let me tell you. Beauty. We're the first one. Hello, Nugget. Good morning to show <laughs> After millions two of years. Two and a half, three. Maybe two ish, two. That's bit. beautiful. About two Congratulations. And a half. Yeah. Yeah, well done. Hard. Well earned. Hard as a rock. Yeah, yeah. Listen, you can leave that open because we can use that for the lavatory now. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, no, this is a good, um, good point. Yeah, fantastic. Congratulations. Well, there you go, folks. Make sure you fill your holes back in. A bit of a digging or something there. Yeah, look at that. God, that's enough to stir up the appetite now. All right, I've got a target here. I've got a lovely assistant help me, Jane. Just hope it's not lead shot. Okay. It's in the scoop, in the scoop. Well, it's in here. Ah, no. <laughs> the dreaded lead shot. <laughs> All right, on with the next. All right, so I've got two bits uh, this afternoon for uh, 0 0.3 of a gram. But uh, it's been cold, isn't it? Three times um, yeah. it uh, hailed. Hailed, uh, or maybe more, and then the wind. And and look now, we just got drenched. We're all wet. This yeah. Yeah. Marty's hands are frozen now. He's a tough man, but for Beautiful, Marty to wear yeah. gloves, he's cold. <laughs> Get that fire on, mate. Yeah. Well, here we got a nice fire. Beautiful fire. Created by all of us. Oh, except for Matt. He's just enjoying it. <laughs> Look at the flames, man, this is a fire. Look at that, Marty. What do you think, mate? Fantastic, mate. You got your green ginger stain there? You've got to have the fire. Uh, oh, yeah, we're getting it nice makes, and warm. <laughs> All right. Absolutely saturated. Thanks, Tim and Jane. We came out, no gold uh, here this afternoon, but we got to catch up, and uh, I think we're going to have a bottle of uh, green ginger stain. That's, oh, that, that's the stuff for campfires. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Family 59, bye for now.